Yeah. Yeah. Obviously West London. Yeah. I used to go to Blackpool quite a lot. Yeah. Yeah. It's a great place, you know. Mm -hmm. I remember when we... It was one tour we did, and uh, we were supposed to get from Edinburgh to Liverpool very quickly. Yeah. You know, and uh, it was really bad snow. We had to hire a plane, really? and uh, we couldn't. It was one of these little eight-seater jobs, you know. Yeah, yeah. You had to sort of take yeah. off like that. No. And uh, we were flying along. Nobody could see where we were going. And suddenly it was like, oh, that's Blackpool Tower over there. <laughs> <laughs> like two inches. That was away. the closest I ever got. It was about ten foot away. <laughs> Listen, we're going to be seeing your your video as you over his shoulder as well. Yeah. Are you all right? Oh, very well, thank you. You love making videos, don't you? Yeah, I do actually. I got a bit, um, got a bit of a bore, but the new one I was really chuffed with. Yes, the reflex, yeah, we'll which we're well. going to be seeing later on. Meanwhile, look at this. This is you when you were nine years old. Yes, John. yes. You those teeth. Look. Good lord. Look, look a real good at those teeth. Actually. Were you good? At, I mean, were you good at school? I don't mean academically good. I mean, were you well behaved? And um, I, I don't know really. I was never there. <laughs> That's not true. That is not true because um, your report apparently says you were keen to learn, always a lively contributor. I think... And uh, your work show creativity and imagination. Really? Yeah. I think they're still talking about art. I think <laughs> mathematics would have been a different story. <laughs> now, what about this? This is, your, this is your house. Was that your first car? No, that was um, my second car. Second car. Aston Martin. Who bought it? You? Mm. It's not what it seems like, you know. <laughs> I mean, it looks so... It's uh, it, a it, It's just I always wanted one ever since I was a kid. I can't drive it now because everybody thinks I'm showing off. So, um, so it's consigned to, it? to the garage. My dad just uses it to go and so get it. So he didn't write it ask some kids for their questions that they wanted to put to Duran Duran, and mm -hmm. particularly to John Taylor. Mm -hmm. Seen that? Are we going to see that? Yes, right, we've just got a few Duran Duran fans here. Do you want to say hello? Say hello, folks. Hello! <laughs> Quite a lot of enthusiasm and loads of questions. So let's kick off around here. What would you like to ask? I'd like to ask any members of the Duran Duran group, did they ever get sick of the fans chasing them all around? <laughs> Do you like people screaming? <laughs> Does sometimes the editors put things in the papers which you haven't really said? What do you think of Boy George? <laughs> John, when you were voted the most fanciable man in Britain, was Simon jealous? <laughs> Any personal questions for the band? John, how many times have you dyed your hair? What do you do in your spare time? What does he do in his spare time? Oh. <laughs> Who'd like yeah. to spend some of their spare time with John? Yeah. <laughs> what, what's your question? Um, what was the favourite video they had they've made, and which was the hardest video to make? <laughs> we better run through those questions, yes, don't we? we right, um, first of all, do they ever get sick of the fans chasing them around? Do you? Um, no, not really. As I was just explaining, the only time was a Heathrow. And I got nearly undid 20 stitches in my foot the other day. But so go easy on him. He's, he's fragile. Yeah, he's, he's precious but, um, property. No, not really. Do you like people screaming? Yeah. He loves it. He loves people screaming. Bit. Do the editors put things in the paper you haven't said? Yeah, a lot of things. A lot of things. Nothing you can do about it, really. Is there? Apart from that, their legs seem to, but <coughs> I don't have a word about it. No, nothing. What do you think of Boy George? Uh, next question. No. Um, <laughs> Cliff, Richard, Cliff Richard said on the programme that he thought he could sing. Do you agree? Cliff Richard? Cliff Richard thought that Boy George could sing. Yeah, he can definitely sing, yeah. Good. When you were voted the most fanciable man in Britain, was Simon jealous? No, no, no. Not at all. Good. How many times have you dyed your hair? I really... Have a look at this. <laughs> <laughs> cheeky, cheeky. Uh, too many times to count. What do you do in your spare time? Think before I answering. Don't really have any spare time. I'm magazines, made magazine friends. Listen I don't have music? any spare time, basically. No, I never listen to music. What music do you listen to? I don't you? really. You don't listen no, to music? No, I've gone off it. I'm... TV programmes? Yeah, watch a lot of videos. Video mad, TV mad. Do you play any sport? What, with this body? <laughs> <laughs> well, no, 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 not no, at all. all. But you all keep quite fit, obviously, do you? Yeah, just from running around on stage, really. Yeah, right. What's the favourite video that they've made, that you've made? The reflex, actually, is definitely. Yeah, Hungry Like the Wolf it was, but now it's been... Oh, and you. And which was the hardest video to make? Um, Save a Prayer and Hungry, probably, the ones in Sri Lanka, because it was very difficult trying to work with people who didn't understand the word the. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, it was very difficult, but oh. uh, good fun. And the reflex was pretty difficult to make, because it was right in the middle of a tour that we were already falling apart at the seams from. Yeah. Well, I'm sure there are thousands of more questions that everybody wants to ask, but at least we've answered some of them. Well, in fact, um, what's going to happen now? Oh, we're go oh, yes, I know. I know what's going to happen now. It's time for that wonderful, amazing, truly incredible game. Pick a pair! Talking of pairs, and well, we've got a right <laughs> pair on screen at the moment. Right? Yes, there they are. <laughs> Listen, you're going to join in this game, so pick up the green frog. I'm going to take it. And the, click it into the, action. The bullfrog by the horn. <laughs> <laughs> Can we have our first contestant? Who is it, please?
Darren Kamak. Sorry? Darren. Darren? Kamak. Darren. Hi, Darren. Do you want to speak to John Taylor very briefly? There he is, from Duran Duran. Are you a Duran Duran fan? Not really. No, well, <laughs> not really my voice. Honesty? Yeah. <laughs> right. Let's see the grid, shall we? Right, can we this call This one's not winning anything, you know that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at those two wonderful superstars there in the middle of uh, Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Right, um, okay then, Darren, do you want to pick a pair? Uh, right, they're the squares that you can't use, so pick a pair. D4. D4. Or B4, what did you say? D4. B4, right. D. B4, yeah. D. Oh, D4. Sorry, D4. <laughs> Watch my lips. D4. Okay, that's a record. Pick a pair again. Um, H3. H3. Right, that means a free subscription to Rail Riders. Okay, pick a pair for the third time. Are you still with us? Go on. Um, He's thinking. Tactics. Mm. He's remembering all the squares. D3. D3. Yeah. <laughs> You see, that's what happens when you don't like Duran Duran. <laughs> you didn't win. Sorry about that. Never mind. Keep watching, Darren. Don't go away. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Okay. Frog n number two. Stay on your green frog. Oh. Stay on your green frog. Oh, yeah. Right. Hello. Who's that? Beth Lewis. Sorry? Beth Lewis. Beth. Hello, Beth. Hello, Beth. You're through to um, John Taylor. Have a few words with him very quickly. Hi, Beth. How are you? Okay, thank you. you are like... you a Duran Duran fan? Pardon? Are you a Duran Duran fan? Yes. Oh, right. Oh. Right, you could, this could be your lucky day. This could be your lucky day, right. <laughs> Good luck with pick a pair. No cauliflower for this girl. <laughs> Off you go, Beth. G3. G3. D3. C. C3. 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 <laughs> oh, dear, C3, a stick of rock. Right, okay. Go on. H5. H5. Yes. Oh, you have won a stick of rock. You see. Good news, that's great. Shame Ray Joan Taylor can't autograph that for you, but he might be able to take a bite out of it for you. Will that do? Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right then, Beth. Thanks for playing. Bye bye. See ya. Bye. Bye, bye bye. And in fact, what will happen is we'll be we'll be um, speaking to Beth again next week because she, as our winner, she actually stays on the line and has another go. Pick a pair. Don't forget, if you want to have a go, send a postcard with your name and telephone number and age and to the usual address, and you can uh, join in. There it is. The picture show, BBC TV, PO Box 27. Manchester, well, we've been talking a lot about the Duran Duran video, mm -hmm. The Reflex, and here it is. In fact, it's the third single to be released from the album Seven and the Ragged Tiger. Here they are, Duran Duran, The Reflex. <laughs> the video, John Taylor, you're, you were watching that. You're obviously really pleased with that video. I am, actually, World Shaft. World Shaft. It's the first video we've done with Russell Mulcahy. Yes. For, for, we, for a while, and yeah. it's good to be back with him again. Where was it shot? Toronto, Maple Leaf Gardens, and uh, over two nights. So how, so how many people were actually in there? Over the two, there's about 30,000, 15,000 a night. It was great. Good. How do you cope with sound? I mean, when there's 15,000 people, you've got to... Really use a lot of speakers. <laughs> yeah. A lot of speakers. That's yeah, great. Nice effects on there. Thanks. Now then, um, Simon Simon Le Bon is probably in bed at this precise moment, probably watching you suffer yeah. on this programme. <laughs> yeah, I'd have But in fact, we're going to make him suffer now, because <laughs> look at this. This is a snap of Monsieur mm. Le Bon. As a baby. Still got that kiss curl. <laughs> yes. He hasn't changed, really. Well, this could be his first performance, really. Couldn't it? He went to the same school as Elton John. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't he sort of become the lead singer by accident? Uh, he was in Birmingham yeah. at uh, university doing a drama course. And uh, he was, a girl he was with at the time, was a barmaid at a club we were rehearsing. Mm -hmm. And she just happened to say to him, why don't you go and have a go? It might be a laugh. And we looked at him and said, yeah, bloody right it is. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it was, it was a bit of... Well, you're right at the top, and congratulations on that, and I hope you stay Thanks. there for, you know, as long as you want to. I mean, you just about swept the board, you did everything, really. Best group yeah. in the rock and pop world. sweeping the floor. Be sweeping the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for coming in, John. Thanks, it's a pleasure. Thanks. Thank you. Right, now then, uh, when we were in Blackpool, going back to Blackpool again, Maggie went in...